Okay, today we're going to look at how you can limit the number of responses that you get within a Google form. So let's just say that this is going to be a sign up form. And all I want is for people to type in their name. And so it'll be a short answer. It's going to be required, but I want to limit the number of people that are signing up. Of course, you can be more descriptive here. But all the information I need is just your name. So if I go to the extended menu here, I click on this and I can go to add-ons. And I've actually um, already downloaded this add-on, but it is Form Ranger, a form limiter, I'm sorry. And you'll search for it and then you'll download it. It'll say that it's free. So I've already downloaded Form Limiter. So it will actually be here. So any, any add-ons that you have um, downloaded, they'll be right here at the puzzle piece. So for this one, I'm going to click on the um, puzzle piece. I'm going to click on Form Limiter. I want to set a limit. And I want to set a limit on a max number of responses. You can set it to date or time, but I want a max number. Um, just to show you how it works, I'm going to say greater than three. And then you can put what message you would like to have here. Um, we have reached our limit. Thank you for signing up. And then if you want to say, you know, if you have more questions, email me. I want to be emailed. I'm going to save and enable that. So now the form limiter is done. I am going to preview and I'm going to start signing in. So there's one. And I'm going to submit another response. Two. Three. And if it's greater, it shouldn't work. So this is um, Dracula. I'm going to submit. Oh, I have reached our limit. Thank you for signing up. So once they hit submit, they're going to see that that was um, that they we have reached our limit. So I'm going to go back to our form, and when I look at our four responses. Here are the people that signed in. Um, I have it turned off to no longer accept responses because it did that. Um, if I look at it, um, I can click here and actually create a spreadsheet. And I'll see time and date stamp of when people signed in. So then that you can um, use this as a Google spreadsheet and gather data as you need and add to this or sort it however you need it sorted. But that's how you can use form limiter to um, limit your responses in a Google form. Thanks and have a good day.